Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Aideen. So if you want to see how I got this super cute, girly, glitter, butterfly pink nail design using a prey gel tips, then keep on watching. All right, so I'm starting off with my full cover um, short stiletto a prey nail tips. And this is the way they look. I've been having the same set for over a year and it comes with 500 tips. And then of course the step one, which is the bonder, step two, which is the primer. And then the extend gel and the pot. I like that one better and the brush. All right, you guys. So the first thing what, what, I, what we're going to do is dip our brush into their acetone and we're going to etch out the inside of the nail tip. This will give some type of texture. It'll give texture to the inside of the nail. Okay. And also it will thin out the base of the nail. You can use an e-file with this, but I learned this trick from one of the appraised um, videos. And I do like this trick um, a little bit better because, you know, there's no dust and I just think it's faster. And you can see the difference. You can actually see how on the top right there, it's a little bit cloudy and it's textured. And then the towards the bottom is nice and smooth, which we don't want that because we want the nail to obviously adhere to your natural nail. So here I'm showing you how to do that same step again. All right, you guys, so I have a brand new bottle of Extend Gel. We're gonna open this bad boy up and we're gonna take the lid off. Ooh, look at that gooey magic. <laughs> so we're going to apply a thin layer on your natural nail bed, okay? Don't put too much, just a nice slip layer. Go ahead and do that to all um, four fingers or five fingers. You should like to work with the first four and then do the thumbs last. And after you do that, I'm gonna go ahead and stick it in the lamp to cure it for about 30 seconds. All right, you guys, so the next step will be to take a little ball of gel and you're going to place it on the extension. Sorry, I'm out of focus here. I'll do better next time. So I'm gonna grab a little bit more gel. I'm gonna put it on the base of the extension. And you don't have to overflow the nail because then of course it'll ooze out, you know, the bottom and the side. So here I'm using a little stand just to um, give you more stability and I'm going to place the nail down at a 45 degree angle and go ahead and slowly lay her down. Don't put a lot of pressure because you don't want a lot of gel, you know, to ooze out. And then th this little lamp, I bought that from Amazon and it literally makes me, uh, I could do the whole set hands-free which is way better than I think the lamp that it comes with or using my other method, which was getting um, a flashlight and holding it with my mouth. So I really like this lamp and the lamp was only $17. So I'll go ahead and link that down below. Let's get to the fun part, you guys. Let's go ahead and design. We're going to take a light pink, polish, a glitter, a top coat, some decals, and of course, um, some water, and you'll need some scissors and whatever. So this design is super easy. The base color for all the nails is gonna be this light pink color, which I think is called Bride to Be. I'll put it in the description in the description box. So basically, um, I decided to do the design in the middle finger and the ring finger. I'm going to cut out the butterflies that I like, and I'm gonna dip it in some water, and then you're going to slide those off and place them on the nail according to you know the way you want it to look. And you guys, I was struggling with these little butterflies because um, I don't think I did it right. But anyways. After the first one, everything else went pretty smoothly. All 
All right, you guys, so after that, you're going to take some glitter gel polish and you're going to apply it on the nail. You guys know me, I love girly nail designs, pinks and glitters, you know, it's in my nature, I cannot help it. But anyway, you guys, this is the way the nail looks. Go ahead, after you do that, you're gonna cure it. And of course, apply your top coat. And that basically completes the look, you guys. Look at this design, it's so freaking cute and it's simple, straight to the point. I hope you guys enjoy it. I think it's perfect for like spring slash summer. You guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Let me know what else you guys want to see, okay? Bye now.